Jesus mighty name we have prayed tonight as we are rising as our river is overflowing I want to let you know that there are three rivers that I want, to, I want us to deal with tonight somebody will pray this prayer with me with all your heart take me to my Jordan <laughs> take me to my Jordan there are three categories of people that enter into Jordan and their life never remain the same there are three categories of people in the Bible that enter into Jordan and since then something strange something marvelous something powerful happened in their life you got to get to your Jordan. Somebody is getting to Jordan tonight. 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 Whatever is holding you back from getting to your Jordan, I said the Lord will break them tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus, I come to realize that Jordan is a river that flows and three of them enter into Jordan at different points in time not the same spot but still the same Jordan come on somebody that is to say they enter into Jordan as long as you can connect with your Jordan your miracle is, is guaranteed as long as you can connect your, with your Jordan your miracle is guaranteed they enter into Jordan. Bible made me to understand in the book of Joshua, Joshua chapter 3. Joshua chapter 3 from verse 14 to 17. Joshua chapter 3 from verse 14 to 17. God made the Israelites realize it's about time to move forward and for you to move forward your next assignment it is not what Moses will do for you it is your time to do it yourself come on somebody Moses raised his hands up he stretched his rod over the sea and the water parted but this next assignment this next assignment it involves you you got to get to a place that you will be able to step into your daughter and something will happen because you got to have the other experience you might not have been seeing Moses as what as the miracle worker but that same power that lies in the in the, in the life of in the, in the life of Moses can still rest upon you too as well. You can become the, the carrier of God's power as long as you can connect with your daughter. Something must happen in your life. I declare and I declare upon someone tonight. As you have come to that stable, as you have come to this place tonight, as if something is happening in your life that will change your story and give you a better life because you are getting connected with heaven father and because of that your Jordan must part Amen. come on somebody you have to come to a place and Bible says it gave instruction to Joshua select people I don't want you to do it your own is to select people because out of them they will know that God can still use them so they are part of the people that I want to use maybe you've been doubting about your life you have projects that you have that have been abandoned you have life that you, you, have, you have things that, that, that is not moving forward God is saying to you tonight you've got to step out in faith and you will see the hands of the Lord you've got to step out in faith and see the hand of the Lord you've got to step out in faith and see the hand of the Lord and he said to them as many that step out call them out when they carry the ark the moment their feet step to the bank of that river 
something will happen they will see my hand and by the time they carry that ark and step into it bible made us to understand that all what they have been expecting all what like look like mountain in, in, in i mean before them all what like look impossible before them they saw dry land oh dry land appear Open that by that one, uh, Joshua, book of Joshua, chapter three, from verse fourteen, from verse thirteen, from verse thirteen, Joshua chapter three, from verse thirteen. Oh my goodness, you've got to walk with me quickly. Hallelujah! And as soon as the priest who carried the ark of the lord all of them all they had set their food in the jordan the water flowing downstream we cut off and stand up in the hill and next one says so when the people broke camp and uh, to, to cross the Jordan, the, the, the priests carrying the Ark of the Covenant went ahead of them. God is going ahead of you and you have to follow instruction and he say uh, the moment you cut you, you, your, your feet step into it, uh, I decree and I declare you might have feel before I have come to tell you tonight, uh, carry the Ark again uh, and step into that Jordan, carry the Ark again uh, and challenge that, uh, and challenge that mountain uh, and say I come to you in the name of the Lord I come to you in the name of the Lord is there anyone tonight as you can pray tonight say with me I say I come to you in the name of the Lord I step into this mountain I step into this soldier and you must part whatever is not working you've got to pray with it in the mighty name of Jesus I step into it where things are not working well, step into it. Where things are not working well, step into it. Where you have to be caught, step into it. Where you have problems, call it, carry that act and step into it. You got to step into it tonight. Because as soon as you step into that Jordan, the water that is coming from the stream will stop and you'll be able to see the dry land. You'll be able to walk freely. Yay! As you step into it tonight, yes, you are stepping into your Jordan for deliverance. You are stepping into your Jordan for miracle. You are stepping into your Jordan for that abundance. I decree and I declare whatever look impossible in your life. Oh, 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 step into that Jordan. 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 I step into it. I step into it. Yet akapasuta la 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 ba ha. Ekara da ba da ba da ba da ba da ba. Ele pradosi da ba. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Listen to me. The Lord is speaking to somebody tonight. Maybe you failed before. Go back. Go back. Carry the ark. And say, Lord, I enter into this Jordan in your name. Carrying the word of God. Carrying my project. Carrying your promises. I enter into this ark. I enter into this Jordan. And the Jordan and the Jordan must part for me. I must walk on that dry land. I must receive my miracle. In the in, in, in Jordan, where lies your miracle? I decree and I declare where you have that problem in your life, in your, in your home, in your business, in your marriage, in your, in your ministry, in your I, I decree and I de over your children. I decree and I declare go back to the source. As you step into it, something is happening. Something is happening. Something is happening. 
something is happening something is happening something is happening is there anyone stepping into it tonight 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 say i step into that jordan i step into that jordan in the mighty name of jesus christ thank you father in jesus mighty name we pray stay with me say three powerful amen. amen come on amen. come on amen. louder amen. babu says the moment they step into it that ends the problem in their life they overcame by the blood of the lamb and the word of their testimony listen to me this people step into it and that problem is solved the second person that stepped into jordan can be found in the book of second king chapter five second king chapter five from verse 13 from verse 13 to 14. Second Kings chapter 5 from verse 13 to 14. Here comes a man that has been that has been carrying problem that could not be shared with anybody for a long time. Perhaps you are here, you are listening, you are watching, you are hearing me tonight and there are situations in your life that has been hidden that people do not see but you've been covering with clothes you've been covering with necklaces you've been covering with all manner of things in your life you cannot even share with nobody you don't know how to get over it but yet you are living with it it makes you sad it makes you feel pain but I can tell you tonight there was a man like that covering all his problem despite the fact he happened to be a, a warrior useful to the community useful to the society useful to the country but useless to himself come on somebody useful to the whole community powerful in every area never lost any battle but was a failure to himself. Oh, 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 oh. he tried but never won. He tried but always been defeated. He could not even open his mouth to tell anybody. And those that know the, he knows about it, they made it make it what a top secret that could not be shared with anybody. How do I know people who knows about it, but they don't, know, they don't want to talk, talk, talk about it? Because they know the, the normal thing that happened to the people like that. And they are not ready to lose him. Hey, I decree and I declare. I decree and I declare. Wherever you might be good outside, and people have been blessed to you, but yet you are losing battle ground in your own life. I declare and I declare upon your life tonight. The Lord Almighty will intervene upon your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. There shall be no lost again. And he said. The only thing God gave him, uh, God, gave, God brought help on his way. And when he found help, he ran to the man of God, and the man of God said, Look, listen to me. Your help, your solution to your, your solution to your problem is in the Jordan. Ah, come on, somebody. The only way you can get rescue right now is only if you can manage yourself to get to Jordan. The man looked at himself and said, Out of all the rivers. <laughs> Just like right there, other better rivers are there. Huh? Maybe he knows all the he, he like the all those ones are there. So there is something special, something you know, special about that river. Huh? Maybe that river is smell is smelling, or is a common river. Come on, somebody. Hey, God does not walk by multitude, and he said the only solution. The man of God did not repeat himself. If you like do it if you like don't do it but i know 
your solution lies in that Jordan. If it, if I can just get to that Jordan, my solution will be what will be will be, will be there for me. And the man said he was about to turn around. To turn, turn around. I pray on the day of your miracle. I say you will not be discouraged. Hey, on the day of your miracle, I say you will not be distracted. On the day of your miracle, I say you will not be frustrated. People get frustrated on the day of their miracle, and when they are close to their miracle, that's when something something happened. That will just sway them out of the old, 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 old thing. And they start over again. They start praying over again. When they thought you're supposed to pray, supposed to come and pray. And God says, if you can meet me in the place right now, if you can meet me in the place of prayer. But when they're supposed to meet God in the place of prayer, somebody came, somebody came and talked to them and gave them something, something uh, business. Somebody engaged them and they could not meet up. But I have come to tell you tonight. Tonight is your night that you will meet with your daughter. I say tonight is your night that you will meet with your daughter. And the Bible says, he finally, thank God for good counselors, for good friends, for good people around him. And just tell and, and told him, listen, you've been carrying all this problem, no solution. Even we ourselves, we cannot even talk to you anymore. We, we are trying to cover this. We, we only have this solution right now. If you can just don't dip yourself, let us see. Either you are, will be clean or you will not be clean. Just do what the man of God said. We traveled all this, all this way, all the way to this place, and you want to turn back. Devil is a bastard. I said, Devil is a bastard. But he, 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 he listened. He listened. And Bible says, He did himself. In other words, why will you have to do it seven times before you walk, before you make home? He did himself. Can you guys see me now? <laughs> Nothing is changing. You have tried. You have tried. Hey. People are doing it and they are making it. But you tried your own and nothing is forthcoming. And you failed and said, What is what is wrong with me? What is wrong with this head? It's like this head is not even correct. It's the one kind of head that I have. But God is saying to you, I don't you with other people i work with you as an individual and i have a set time on your life i have a set time on your life i have a worst time on your life when the time clicks when your time clicks you will be you will enter into your newness you will enter into your newness you will get into your jordan you will get into your miracle stop comparing yourself with other people Deep himself seven times. Why do I have to continue to do this thing? Even the water is smelling. The more I dig myself, the more I carry debts, the more more it comes of me. Everything is just looking awkward. And they just keep begging me. This is just the second time doing it again and he went back again and did himself he came out nothing at the time they all, you all turn around don't worry don't worry just keep doing it don't, don't worry don't worry don't, don't, just keep doing it and he kept doing it the fourth time the fifth time the sixth time he was almost getting discouraged what is the point about doing it again but at the seventh time he made he just let, let, let this is the last time i'm going to do this thing this is the last time i'm going to do this thing this is the last time i'm going to do this thing and he went for the last time he went for the last time and his story changed right there because he went in as a leopard man but when he came back up, he came back, woke up with a new, with a new flesh. Yes. Leprosy sank, and the newness emerged. Hey, I decree upon someone tonight. I decree upon someone tonight. It does not matter how many times you have tried. I can tell you tonight, the moment you get to your Jordan, your newness will show up. I said your newness will show up. Your newness will show up. Your newness will show up. I said the newness will show up. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say to the, say to the Lord tonight. Lord. 
I'm going back to that order. I did myself in the mighty name of Jesus. I come back up with a testimony. I did myself in the mighty name of Jesus. Just like Naaman did. I am coming back up with a new life. I am coming back up with a new life. I did my marriage. I did my children. I did my ministry. I did my my work. I did my business. Yes. You've got to do it. You've got to do it. You've got to do it. This is your season. This is your moment. This is your season. This is your moment. You've got to get you got to do it. You can't give up right now. God is doing something. Oh I am Nebo Shakayara, Ibara Dadosa, E Lana Mashapara, E Gaba Sukehande, E La Pena Manda Dabaraba, E Alabasata, in the mighty name of Jesus. I am not giving up. I am not giving up. I am not giving up. I am not throwing down tower. Yes. The world might be looking at me like a failure, but I am not a failure. Hey, I'm not a failure. Hey, I'm not a failure. I am not a failure. I am getting somewhere. I'm getting somewhere. I'm getting. I'm getting somewhere. Thank you, Father. Ooh. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Say three powerful, Amen. Listen, the third person that got into Jordan, Matthew chapter 3, verse 13 to 17. Matthew chapter 3, verse 13 to 17. It's about a story when Jesus, John the Baptist, has been baptizing people in the Jordan and he only baptized them to salvation. Jesus came. Come on, somebody. The moment he got into that same place, that's why I said Jordan has many faces. The same Jordan is a stream, is a long stream. That when you, you just need to approach it at, at any at any place, at any place, you the moment you hear Jordan, just run to that place. Because there is something about that place. About, about that place that runs. <laughs> Listen to me. Jesus got to that Jordan. And at that place, something happened. He went in as a man but when he came back out oh come on somebody the power of God rested so much upon him to the point that Bible says the heaven opened in other words at that same Jordan heaven opened at that same Jordan heaven opened at that same Jordan heaven open Amen. that means you can get to your Jordan and your heaven will open Amen. that is every heavens that have been closed come on somebody every womb that has been closed every opportunity that has been closed every life that has been closed every marriage that has been closed every church, every church that has been closed ministry that has been closed I decree and I declare as you enter into that Jordan as, as you enter into that Jordan your heaven shall be open hey, your heaven shall be open If you remember very well, you will know that we said this year is our year of turnaround. Come on, somebody. Year of turnaround. And in your year of turnaround, there will be what? Flowing river. 
Come on, somebody. Li breke bo shap ala gada gada. He na mando sike para gada gada gada. Li pra gada 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 gada. You will lift up your voice tonight and say, Father, tonight let my heaven open. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, I pray in that name of Jesus. Whatever has closed my heaven, whatever has closed my heaven, whatever has shut my gate, I decree tonight. Open! 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 I stepped into that Jordan. I step into that Jordan. I step into that Jordan. I step into that Jordan. My heaven is opening right now. 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 In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I close with this. In that last verse of that Matthew chapter 3, verse 17, the last part of it, the heaven did not just open. A voice came out of that heaven, open heaven. The voice that came, came with authority and comfort. Come on, somebody. Verse 17 says what? See, and a voice from heaven said, affirmation, this is my son. Come on, somebody. The Lord is saying, this is my daughter. Oh, this is my servant. Oh, this is my son. Oh, this is my son. In whom, come on, in whom I love, and I am well pleased. Listen, affirmation that comes with comfort. Come on, somebody, God endorsed you. I said, God endorsed you. God endorsed you and he said in whom I loved and I am pleased well pleased from today people will embrace you hey from today people will embrace you from today people will embrace you every God is sending you out and give commands to everyone that sees you must bless you everyone that sees you must associate with you everyone that sees you must see favor in your life and they must acclimatize themselves with you i decree and i declare because everyone has already endorsed you nobody can detroy you nobody can detroy you nobody can remove you in the mighty name of jesus christ lift up your voice tonight and say as for me and my household we are endorsed by heaven we are ever endorsed by heaven in the mighty name of jesus christ so we walk in authority we walk in authority we walk in power we walk in victory we walk in abundance we walk in miracle we walk we walk we walk come on decree 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 it decree it decree it decree it decree it decree it, decree it. hey i walk in authority I walk in authority. I walk in abundance. I walk in boldness. I walk in grace. I walk in favor. I walk, I walk, I walk in power. Oh, shah. I walk in strength. I walk in strength. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I'm not talking to everybody right now. I'm also talking to people that have 
that, that, that had encounter with their Jordan already. I'm talking to people that had encounter with the Jordan already and have received transformation over the Jordan tonight. And those are the people that I want you to shout a louder hallelujah. Wherever you are, shout a better hallelujah. Because things are turning around for you for good. I yeah, say shout hallelujah. Because the shouting side is the winning side. And I know the Lord has done you so good. I decree and I declare whatever the Lord has done in your life shall remain permanent in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Glory be to your holy name, Father. Father, we want to thank you tonight. We want to bless your holy name. We give you praise for what you've done. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you for your loving kindness. Thank you for your marvelous work. Thank you for whom you are in our lives. Thank you for your gracious work in our family. We thank you because you are always there for us. Oh, even when no one is there for us, you are always there to help. We may not be, we may not see you, but we know that yet, you are yet, you are yet there for us, oh God. Thank Heavenly Father, Lord, because your word is yea and amen. As you have prayed tonight, may that grace may that power Amen. rest upon us Amen. everyone that entered with jordan they came back out a new life we are in, uh, we, uh, we entered into that jordan tonight Amen. our life is transformed Amen. testimony begins Amen. in the name of jesus christ Amen. thank you dear lord thank you most heavenly father in Jesus mighty name we pray Amen. I believe if you have prayed that prayer something gracious thing something marvelous is happening in your life already Amen. don't hide it give us your testimony report and we want to hear your testimony and I know that it will bless the life of other people and if you are if you are if, uh, uh, if you 